Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how to permanently delete um, screen recording or screen watching programs on a school computer. Now this works for Chromebooks, desktops, all that kind of stuff. Don't know about iPads because I don't know. My school has a few classrooms with iPads, but I don't know for a fact about those. But this should work the same. Now my school use is uses NetOp, which is um, a pretty popular program but yeah let's get into the requirements for this all you're gonna need is a school managed computer or Chromebook obviously well it doesn't have to be school managed but anything that has net op is normally school managed and then a school Google account like if we go into the list of my Google accounts as you can see right here is my school account this is my um uh, sorry, YouTube account. Sorry, I can't talk today. This is my school one. I am using my YouTube account because my school one. This is my home computer because I'm at home. So my school account won't let me access to Google. It's just real, okay? They just don't want you to go onto the account to be on your home computers on at my school. But yeah, if I'm delaying this video even more, let's get into it. All you're gonna want to do is go to Google. Make sure you type. Make sure you're in. You sign into your school account. Go to Google account and like just type it in on Google. And here, this is Google account. The link. Just a minute, it'll load. This is my Google, my account dot Google dot com. And here it is. It says hi, welcome, blah blah blah. And you're gonna come up with this. or said before. This one's like a little ch checkup and all this crap, random crap. You don't have to worry about any of these. All you have to worry about is this. It says security issues found. Or it might not say that. It might say you're all good. But you're going to want to press on this. And you have all of these. Don't worry about any of these except this. It said food party access. When you click on this, you're going to have a lot of random games. You know, me or my friends have been playing on my f phone. Because, you know, my Google account's linked to my new Android phone. Anyway, so at your school, you're going to probably have... Um, stuff maybe like Khan Academy if your school does that or anything else but you're gonna scroll down and for my school it's called NetOp Vision for students and all you're gonna wanna do is when you find out whatever your screen recording software is click remove access and when you click remove access um, sometimes a little box saying are you sure will come up you'll click yes or sometimes it won't but yeah you just click on that and once that's all done there's one more step all you're gonna wanna do is on a Chromebook you're gonna wanna control shift QQ, also known as sign out. You're gonna wanna sign out, sign back in. If you're on a desktop, you're gonna wanna sign out, sign back in, or turn it off and turn it back on, depending on what kind of desktop you have. But just to be safe on desktop, I normally turn it off, turn it back on. But on Chromebook, just control shift QQ, shut the lid, wait a couple seconds, open it back up, sign back in. And instead of it coming up to a little pop up in the middle of the screen or a little side, whatever your school uses, saying, Do you want to share your screen? You have to click yes, it's the only option. A little box will come up saying, Do you want to sign in? What account do you want to use to sign in to use the NetOp or whatever? You're just going to, instead of clicking the account, you just want to click the X, which will be somewhere up here for NetOp. If you use a different program at your school, then you might not get a notification. And then, yeah, there it is on no screen order to show up as you're not on a computer because you don't have the program. So it won't show up that you're denying it. It'll just show up that it's not even there. So, yeah, that's the uh, most easiest, basic version of what I do for me and my friends at school. If you like the video, please like and subscribe. And I hope this helped. If it did, make sure to share it to your friends so they can, you know, get this done. And I will see you guys all in the next video. Yeah.